let's talk about Chennai Super Kings then, because what they've done is more importantly keep him in the Jadeja, but they've released Dwayne Bravo. Only time will tell if they'll buy him back or that he goes the Paul Hard route and becomes one of the coaches under Fleming. Uh, what's your gut feel, uh, boys? We'll start with Somesh here in terms of CSK. Uh, talk to me. Uh, I mean, so um, mostly Chahar is back. So Chahar, if Chahar is fit, that lifts their side up. Uh, yeah. At least when the bowling department is concerned, and given Mukesh Chaudhary had a decent season, so they don't really need an overseas pacer. Uh, yeah. They they released uh, Dwayne Bravo because uh, they played Dwayne Pretorius last time around, and they now know that he can fill his shoes with those wide yorkers and slowers and can bat in the lower order as well. But for CSK, the, yeah, that because because they they played Mukesh Chaudhary the full season and sort of are relying on him. They, then they have uh, uh, Simranjit as well, if I'm not mispronouncing his name. Oh yeah, Simranjit, Simranjit thing. Yeah, uh, but but uh, again, the the issue with CSK remain the same, which were, which they were last time around. Uh, Ambati Raidu, I mean, is does he still? Is a good enough batter to be playing in this league? Uh, MS Do you Dhoni, think so? we know can MS Dhoni finish off against bowlers who are not Jade Unatkat? <laughs> and uh, again, Shivam Dubey, yeah, he's a he's a spin basher, but uh, he, but do you like the a, fact he's, he's a limited he player like Raidu and stuff? Because I know Uthapa is retired, but Raidu just because he's flexible can bat in any of those top five positions. He's a hard hitter. Still has it in him or no? So this is what for us to find out when the season commences. Yeah. Uh, they bat deep. Uh, in my 11, they can actually have Dhoni batting at 8. And that would be one spot above Deepak Chahar. So he can even bat at 9. So they, they yeah. have a deep batting lineup. Uh, I have a feeling they will be... I mean, a lot of teams will, but they will be one of the teams who would want to add... Uh, Maybe Mayank Agarwal in their mix because they, I, that I was them... going to ask you that next. Because do you think he's that, a kind of a CSK batter? I mean, if I'm Mayank Agarwal, I would want to play in CSK, of course. And but uh, but do they have the budget for him? I'm not sure because there are other teams who'd want him as well. How much do you think he'd go for? Roughly at the top of your head, eight crore, I nine think, crore. I I think ten ten plus crores. Okay, good, Kira. Here's the thing. Uh, CSK, I think, would need uh, would will need someone who's who's very good against pace uh, and not just not just pace but uh, movement as well. Huturaj sometimes struggles against movement. Uh, Conway is good and uh, Conway is so that, so that sort of rules out Mayank. Yeah, that that that's what I was coming to because Mayank has had in the re- one of the reasons or one of the underlying reasons why Mayank has been struggling in the last year or so. Is uh, is his game against pace? He's really struggled against movement. Uh, when the one of the reasons uh, he struggled in the last IPL was because in Mumbai in Maharashtra the ball was moving around, the new ball was moving around, and he was getting squared up. He was, yeah. it, it was not really a good reflection on him, and I think that is also something that played a part in him getting dropped from the Test team as well. So uh, yeah. I don't see Mayank uh, going there. What about someone so, like Manish? Ritwik goes on to ask you, Gurpreet. I'd be very surprised, and I'm not. I don't want to be harsh, but I'd be very surprised if Manish Mandi gets a bid because he's. I think for four seasons in a row. Yeah, can they do what with, they did with Uttapa with Manish? Just give him a role and be like, you know, just go and explore your game. Don't worry about it. I think. Uh, I think teams have tried that, and uh, what I also think is, I don't think that MS Dhoni really, uh, you know, has a lot of belief in. In someone like Manish Pandey, because and and it's it's not something that I am saying out of thin air, because yeah. you have to see how much matches or how many games did Manish Pandey play for India when MS Dhoni was the captain, or you know when and he pl- was. And plus that captain. famous video of both of them, <laughs> we like kida dekh ra. <laughs> <laughs> no, but that oh. that apart, I think uh, 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 Manish Pandey really has himself to blame, and he's he's not set the domestic stage on fire as well. So Great. yeah, for for me, I I don't see uh, that happening. I think. Uh, what uh, what what uh, CSK needs is pro- probably a number three or a number four batter who can be really good against space. Uh, mm-hmm. Ruturaj and Conway they are sorted with. Uh, 
I thought think, that they had they to, to bank to someone like Sam Curran. Sorry, Gurkhia. Because of Sam Curran's great success so far recently. See, I think they'll try going for him. But uh, his success came with the ball on, and not really with the bat. Uh, so, we will... I, I don't know if it's going to be a safe bet. But I, I think I, what I thought last season was that they paid uh, six crores was too much what, what they were paying for Ambati Raidu. And here's here's my issue with CSK. Uh, we know that Ambati Raidu announced his retirement. And then that retirement was taken back with the CEO coming and saying that he's he just said it because he got emotional and everything. We know what has happened with Ravindra Jadeja as well, him yeah. beating all those posts on social media. Now, my, my issue is, now you know that two of your players who've been, who've been uh, you know, good servants of the franchise for a long time, uh, they've showed their displeasure and they've not really wanted to be a part of the franchise. Why are you trying to keep them? Because, and the reason why I'm saying that, why are you trying to keep them is that we've still not heard anything uh, from either Jadeja or from Raidu. That why yeah. did these things happen, right? We still haven't heard from Jadeja why he gave up the captaincy. So, you know, even if, say, players have quality and they are in the form of their lives or touch of the lives, I'm not really sure, you know, keeping those two players or anyone in an environment which they are very reluctant to be can get the best out of them. That is my concern with CSK. And, uh, and knowing yeah. that it's Dhoni's potentially last season, boys, the fact that he's returning to Chepok in 2023 is being dubbed as this whole thing is we're doing it for Tala. He'd need a team which is pretty much going to go there and pull a, a rabbit out of the bag, potentially, right? So, do you think CSK can do that? I mean, if they get someone like Sam Curran, they still haven't, we haven't seen someone like Hunger Yaker and all of them. You think yeah. those are see, see one of the advantages of CSK is they always bat deep, and this is yeah. where this is this is their big strength in my opinion because that allows their players to bat freely, and this is why I think Uttapa was able to uh, you know strive there, and even Shivam Dubey has done well. Uh, in terms of targeting players, I think I won't be surprised if they go for someone like a KS Bharat or even Karun Nair, given the kind of players uh, CSK usually want. I mean players who who are already, you know, at a certain level. I, 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 I'm not saying if, uh, that would be a good choice because, you know, you you expect some things from some players, but in CSK color, they just, you know, it just exponentially improve. So that can happen. I mean, KS Bharat has been in, in the India setup for the red ball. So that means he has a red ball game. So which probably, you know, can come in his favor, like a player who can play pace well. I'm not really sure because I've not looked at him closely, but I'm, I won't be surprised if CSK might go for players like these. Hmm. Is Tixana released or what says Lucky Music? Or, or no, he's, 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 he's there, he's there. Yeah, he's, he's there. Good. And Arjun Sharma going on to say, Jadeja posted about restarting afresh in CSK post moments ago. So, I mean, CSK always but have I, a knack. knack of yeah, but all that no... Knowing IPL, knowing India cricket, I don't think we'll get those answers that Gurkira pointed out ever because I, I've never seen these things answered. Not just CSK, but anywhere. Just uh, we just only get the surface. People just only scratch the surface. We don't get details ever. Yeah, 